myself dreaming in silver and gold, like a scene from a movie that I For the girls. What's up, I fam? So we've just taken a little short drive up the road to Otley Shevin, which is this place pretty much. It's super pretty, like foresty type or whatever. And we're just on a little mission right now to tie Prinny out because we do have some plans for later today, but we need Prinny to be tied out and have had a good day first. Yeah. <laughs> There's probably loads of you really confused right now as to what a Winnie Woo is or a Winnie Woo Den. It's one of these. But yeah, it looks like so. <laughs> we Winnie Woo's at Ewoks, okay? That's just what we'll, we'll just yeah. leave it there, guys. Comment below if you know why or what we might have done in this woods at one time quite a while ago that was pretty special and awesome if you know comment below what like big thing yeah. especially big thing for our channel happened in these woods a long time ago now <laughs> No big surprise guys with the film choice. We're actually going to see a film called Family, Instant Family, that's it. So we're just walking out of the cinema right now. We actually went to see a film called Instant Family, which was, it was so good. the best film ever. I like, cried about eight times. <laughs> yeah, it was so nice. It's, um, sorry, it's really windy if the camera's picking up loads of wind noise right now, but it was a film, of, like a, it's a real feel good film about adoption um, and it was, it was the best film choice ever. All of us literally like looked at each other when it finished. Isabel came and gave me a massive hug and then we all had a hug and it was just really, really sweet and nice. It was super, super cute. If anyone's thinking about going and seeing that film, go and see it. It is bitterly cold outside today and really windy right now, but we're just talking about what we fancy to eat. Everyone's, everyone's. Everyone wants different. Chris wants, oh, actually, what do you want? I want candy. What do you want? I want What did you want? What did you want again? I said I'm not hungry, I'm going to go home and have like <laughs> crumpets. These guys don't want to go to Nando's. Esme and I have fancy Carberry. Isabel wants Nando's and Chris wants five guys. Oh, that's a bit of an array of choice there, it's alright. I'm just taking shelter under my boot right now because their heaven's opened and it is raining. Really, really heavy. Are you going? Okay, bye. <laughs> okay, bye. Everyone's going and leaving me. Okay, bye. Okay, baby, you stay with me, yeah? So we decided to come to um, like a pub type restaurant because then everybody can just choose. Oh, bye. Everyone's deserting me. I've got to lock the car, guys. <laughs> so we decided to come to a little pub type restaurant just to get some dinner tonight because then everyone can choose what they want. And people who don't want, etc., don't have to have, etc. Oh my goodness, I'm getting killed right now with rain. <laughs> What's up guys? We just took an hour drive from home. If you've ever been to the North Yorkshire area and been up here, you will know it is incredible. We last came here on a very special day. If you guys know, comment below, because I'm not telling you just yet what it was. I'm gonna build that excitement and that suspense up. But if you know when we last came here, it was a really special day. We did something right here at this spot last time we came that was super special. So yeah, comment below if you know. Check out that view. <laughs> This place is actually way more dangerous than you'd think it is. Like obviously there's loads of families here climbing rocks and stuff, but actually it's so dangerous. That that drop is ridiculous. In fact, I can't even look at it. It's making me feel funny. But we've just come up here. We've just got out of the car. We've just found a little spot right on top of this rock right here that we're gonna sit down and have a bit of a picnic. I'm all good as well. This is crazy. So who's ready for so if any of you guessed right, last time we came here, we came here because we were celebrating 16,000 subscribers. 
back in something like August in 2016 was the last time we were here. That's a long time ago. That's almost three years ago since we've been here at Bremen Rocks. But that was the last time we were literally, we did like, we wrote a big 16,000 on a rock and said thank you. I'm... Yeah, it was definitely 16 count. Show the thumbnail was that as well. It was the 16 count of rock. <laughs> well, all my bets were on today for four days overdue. Today is four days overdue. And it's... my bets were for today. But I was basing that on Isla and Isla was in juice, so that doesn't really make sense. So we're just all back from our trip out this afternoon. We've all done dinner. The girls are currently just playing on the Xbox upstairs right now. Me and Sarah didn't want dinner tonight because we're both pretty full from our picnic that we had this afternoon. But we got back and we were both just like properly craving some of these bad boys. Some hot cross buns. Wait, have you bought chocolate hot cross buns? Oh, I thought these were them, like currant ones, you know, like with raisins in and that. Currants! Man, I just bought chocolate ones. Currants! Yeah, none of this chocolate. Who would choose currants over ra over chocolate chips? That's gonna melt when I put these in the in the grill to hook, That's hook them up, the they're gonna melt. Point. Oh no, I'm disappointed now, man. Comment down below, guys, would you choose chocolate chips? Oh, come on. See, I was even fancying some of these or something like cheese on toast. I might have to just resort to my whole cheese on toast. Cheese on toast with a bit of Perinays on. And because Sarah's a bit of a legend, she actually went to the shop. I just ran out of Perinays last night and got me some more. So, nice one for that, babe. Perfect. Messed up. Yeah, told you. They are nasty. Nasty, mate. In, in, nah. It needs to be currants. Hot cross buns okay. needs to be currants. Chocolate chip? No. <laughs> <laughs> Okay, we definitely need a live baby to try this out on. Oh, yeah, that was a really stupid thing to say. We need a, <laughs> we need a dummy baby to try this out. A live baby? So I'm gonna go grab Avia, Esme's doll. Right, Esme's doll, Avia, where are you? Well, right. So this dog is way too full of energy, so I'm gonna put on my freestyles and I'm gonna head down for a walk with her and try and tire her out before it's school home time. <laughs> Nothing like the smell when you get out of your car and your whole driveway just smells like amazing food. When, when you get out of your car and you're thinking, oh, I wish that was my house that smelled like that. Yeah, then it is. On a Friday night, it And then is. I walk in and it actually is my house that smells <laughs> that good. It smells so nice in here. Yeah. Just, I don't know what's going on, but it looks really good. Added. Nice. I'm actually gutted as well because I don't know if you guys can see the colours so bad on this camera right now. This is my big DSLR that I use, the Canon 80D. And for the last couple of nights, the colour's been like this. It shouldn't be like this, it should be complete crystal white, clear, bright colour and it's not, it's yellow and orange. And it looks really bad. I think my camera might be broke. <laughs> okay. Yeah. Fun fact of the day guys, this time, seven years ago, in Isla's pregnancy, Sarah was at the hospital right now, about to get induced at three days and something overdue. Yeah, I was. Oh my gosh, I'm so uncomfortable. Man. So comfortable right now. She's not having a good oh. night tonight. Anyway, that is everybody getting ready for bed right now. And we're gonna do the same and say good night. We're watching Baptiste. Baptiste. Yeah, on your recommendations, we're watching Baptiste. It's not on Netflix. No, it's on BBC iPlayer, but we need some more recommendations, guys. We always need recommendations. I feel like we watched everything on Netflix, so we need some really good suggestions. Because if not, my nights just suck so bad. No, I've got I've got something else we can watch after we finish Baptiste, actually. Okay, cool. But um, I had something else to tell you guys, but I'm trying to remember what it was now. Oh yeah, right, everybody, including me. Including all of Ireland and the girls teachers of all bet Saturday is gonna be the day So you never know maybe there'll be a vlog tomorrow night. No, there will be a vlog tomorrow night because that's this one There'll be a vlog every night anyway. We're not missing a night. No, you're right. We're not missing a <laughs> night We're not them vloggers. We're them vloggers that get them vlogs out even when people are in labor We'll have that vlog out to you guys on time as well on time We hope. <laughs> but keep an eye out because you never know tomorrow might be the day on social media Instagram etc etc 
might be the day. You just never know. But England from your seven, it could be tomorrow. You never know. We've said that every day this week, but it's probably getting really boring saying that now. Yeah, yeah, so guys, my bad. <laughs> but anyway, we're gonna say goodnight. My battery's flashing red right now, which is telling me I need to shut up and get off and go. So that's what I'm gonna do. Thank you so much for watching, guys. Good night, guys. Make sure you give this video a big thumbs up. Don't forget, and we'll see you tomorrow night at 5 p.m. Good night, guys. <laughs>